what's going on YouTube um, it's been a while I've uh, been busy with the whole inventory that I got from the old video game store but I'm um, here at Katie and we did get some trades but of course already in the system and price I believe these game war games GBA games Fire Emblem Mega Man Zero Kingdom Hearts Final Fantasy and Zelda and Pokemon Yellow and of course on PS1 games some PSP games. But where's the good stuff at, George? Right here on this side. The stuff we get for a dollar. This stuff we got for one. Hold on, playing. So <laughs> these are some pretty rare uh, horror games and a uh, really rare fighting game. Uh, one of my favorite series is Bloody Roar. Resident Evil, we got Silent Hill, Fatal Frame, Galarians, Shadow Hearts, Dragon Guard. Um, pretty good titles. We got E7, The Ark of Napishtim, uh, Soul Reaver 2, Silent Hill 3, Clock Tower 3. So, if you guys really want these, you might have to break a leg or two to try to grab them. Cause right. Everybody, yeah, everybody's going to want them. <clears throat> Played them a lot when I was a kid. What else have we got that I haven't post? Of course, that PS3 with games, which ain't really yeah. nothing big. Nothing too big, yeah. Besides this, the collection that we got. Thir 32 X games, which I need to take to Jones. Yeah. We got our dollar bin. Sports games, comic games, you know, they both for a dollar. So yeah, we're bringing a couple trays, but just been so busy. Got PS3 controllers now as well. I know people have been asking us, so definitely. Yeah, but it is the good stuff right here. Yeah. So if I get any more stuff, I will post. What's up guys? So we got some uh, cool trades in today. We got a Mario Kart 64, Mario Party, Mario Party 7 for the Nintendo GameCube, one of my favorites, Double Dash, and Mario Party 8. But we also got something really special. You promise? I do promise. A huge promise. Big promise. Haunting Ground. An extremely rare, rare horror game. Great condition. It's almost brand new. It's actually one of Capcom's, if not Capcom's, last game on the PS2. Last horror game. It's up there too. It's pricey. Mm -hmm. It's really crazy. And we still got our dollar bins. <laughs> All these games are our dollar. Not a lot, but you know, a little good title game for the PS2 and a couple of games for the GameCube and 64. Yeah. If we get anything else, I will show you. All right, Mr. Dylan. Oh. <laughs> He's bringing in some trades. Spiral, a new beginning. This was a limited run game, huh? Yep. And of course, a 360 game. These three. He's trading these three. And he's also getting. What are you getting, Mr. Dylan? Forever Kingdom. From Software. PS2. Is it a good game? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, it's not really that good. It hasn't aged well, but. Um, it's the prequel to Evergrace, which was a launch game on the PS2, and I've always wanted to try it out. Well, you're probably going to get it, man. Add it to the collection. 
So yeah, if we get any more trades, I will show you. All right. <laughs> so Mr. Dennis also getting the advanced SP. Hey. Nintendo. And Mr. George just came with the food. Oh. Mm -hmm. By time, George, I'm hungry, man. I'm hungry. <laughs> so he's trading um, this couple games, man. And uh, he's getting the, um, this game right here in the SP. Oh, From that big inventory that we got, um, we did end up getting some Se uh, Sega Saturn games, Dreamcast, and Sega CD. Of course, it's only disc, but still some good titles, except for the PS1. I don't know if I showed this to y'all on the video, so if I did, I'm sorry. But if not, well, here it goes. Uh, for Sega Saturn, Bomberman, Sonic Jam, Batman Forever, X-Men, some good titles. And some Dreamcast, some Sega CD, Shining Force back there, and of course the PS1 games. Just wanted to show you right quick. And the Game Gear games. I don't know if I showed y'all that too. 